Today, we're gonna check out the finale for Gundam Witch for Mercury. Let's jump into it. Look her appeal. But before we do, if you enjoy the video, like, comment, maybe subscribe to the channel because most of you are not subscribed and we're trying to hit 50,000 by the end of the year, which is possible with your help. And you can find the full link as well as exclusives over on Patreon plus a couple of things. I did say that we're gonna start Iron-Blooded Orphans next week, Sunday. So like on the, on the 9th, but I've actually changed my mind because there's a lot of anime coming out on Sunday. So I think instead we're going to be starting it Wednesdays, which means this Wednesday, I will be uploading episodes one and two of Gundam Iron-Blooded Orphans. And you can expect videos every Wednesday until we finish Iron-Blooded Orphans. And that ties into my next announcement. On Wednesday, I will be building this. It'll be my first ever gunplay, gun, is it Gunpla? Is that how, how is it supposed to say Gunpla? Gunplay? I don't know. It'll be my first build ever. I have not done one of these before. I am excited. Um, I will have looked up some different builds in order to understand where I'm supposed to snip things and like sand things and like, boop, 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 you know? But that doesn't mean I don't need your help. So stop by my Twitch stream this Wednesday, twitch.tv slash Joefresh. This link is down in the description. And maybe you want to help me out with a little backseat building. This guy's such an asshole. He needs to die for sure. Oh. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh my god, no. Damn. That's what my aerial is gonna look like when I'm done building it. <laughs> What if Aerie's like inside of her? A two for one. That didn't seem very confident, right? That didn't, I don't know. She's like, I'll go make some tea. Like a sweat drop and everything. <laughs> That's an interesting symbol on her, on her head. Oh, oh my god. Wow, this motherfucker's an asshole. Pretty knew that though, with his first attack. Pump it louder. Damn. Fuckers, man. Just a bunch of fucking fuckers. Oh yeah, this motherfucker would 100% definitely like blast through his own peoples, right? I brought, I brought my big sister with me. She's really big. She's a robot. Don't be fooled by her! Ah, she's a fucking she's evil! Don't believe her! Thank you! Yes! Oh, interesting. So what will you do to keep her from being lost? What you about to do? Just blow this shit up? She's entering the matrix. Oh! The real Elon! Oh wait, no. I lied. Who is that? Wait, it is! Yeah, that's what I thought! Uh our Elon, the original. Not the real, but the original. The one that we care about, man. What are we beginning? Oh, 
She's in there. She's in there. Oh no. Is she gonna die? Oh, okay, so she's combining with her. Oh, okay, okay. Shoot that shit, bitch, you won't. That's what that's what Mary Arena was saying. Yeah. Oh shit. The league's high cancel. Oh, oh, she's spilling the beans, bro. She's spilling the beans with Grassley. Oh, What a magnificent beard on that man. Fuck you, you damn toad woman. Hope you burn. Damn. Get fucked, you ugly freaking toad ladies. Oh, shit. Damn, is she all bright and shiny. <laughs> the 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 barely, uh, barely intact airy helping out Ariel, helping out. Bro, what I really need is I need a I need a gunpla of the new one that that Celeste is in. Right, I forgot the name of it. Deal with it. Don't get mad at me. That one, carrying the broken <laughs> Ariel. That's what I need. Damn, what the fuck? They're going to quiet down this satellite till it reaches zero. That's what quiet zero is. Yeah. Get fucked. In fact, make it implode and kill them all. Yes. That's what we should do. No, they don't deserve that. But he does. And so does the, the, the fucking toad ladies. Oh. Papa. Grandma? Everybody else that died in episode zero? Oh. oh, somebody's gonna find a way for her to be forgiven. Wait, what the fuck? You're not dead yet. Why are you why are you in here? Oh, are they part of the everyone? Bro, I don't know why, but I thought it was just like failed clones of Airy. I thought it was like Airy and like Airy 2, Airy 3, Airy 4, like whatever, all the way till Saleta. That's what I thought it was, but that's not what it is. It's like Airy, um, Prospera's dad, a uh, uh, husband, uh, Prospera's mentor. The other people that died in episode zero, those are all the pieces. That's the everyone. Oh, I did not know that. That's interesting. So Papa's been with Ari this whole time. Happy birthday.
Weren't they on the ship? Weren't people on the ship? I'm a little confused. It looked like... Wait, yeah, everybody's just floating in space now? They accidentally run into her. Oh, good. Nope. Oh. Oh, Mirine, okay. She ain't dead. Stop. Stop. Stop the cap. Wait, is she? Oh. Okay, I knew she wasn't dead. Man, she's about to drown in her fucking suit, man. Oh, so everybody gets rescued. Everybody, it all works out. Three years later. Okay. Nika! She's finally out of prison? Hey, do you, girl. I mean, I don't fuck with the haircut, but hey, you do you. Yeah, <laughs> choo choo. I'm not gonna fucking cry again. Oh man, what? Oh, he's going and exploring these places that she has there. Ah. Oh. Oh. That's good. Your sister in law's. Whoa, whoa. Sister in law's advice. Did Prospera and hold on what? <laughs> oh, Petra! Wait, that's Petra. She's alive. She lived. Oh wow, dude! I thought she was deaded. Wait, there's chance. There's a chance others could be alive too. No, probably not. But I can't believe that. Oh my god. Oh, they put him in the. Well, that's a feel good, happy ending. <laughs> Yo, I feel bad for Prosper down there. How the fuck is she getting up? Yeah, the, the the normal ending for this part two would not have worked here because that shit is sad. That was good, man. That was good. I like the feel good ending. I think I'm gonna give it a nine. I think I'm gonna give it a nine. This is my first Gundam, okay? And I don't think it's a terrible place to start with Gundam. We get to see redemption for 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 Prospera. We get to see that all of the, the gun bits, those are all like the people that were lost in the prologue. Airy. Basically, they they kind of renounce the the the, the giant fighter mechs. Airy becomes like the little thingy, and they kind of step away from the fighting side of Gundam, and they really do push more towards the the helpful like limbs and and all of that stuff that 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 would be so great with Gundam that they kept on talking about throughout the first half and then into the second and stuff. And that's what they actually. It looks like that's what they're actually doing. Mirine does sell off the Benerit group, but she does mention Spatians are just gonna, they're just gonna buy it all up again. It's, it, like the cycle isn't really gonna end because of greed, which sucks, but I get it. It was really cool that, that you know, everything works out in the end. It wasn't like amazing the way it happened. It was just like, basically like, Soleta just convinces Mary and, and says no to her mom and she just has to deal with it. There were some emotional moments. There were definitely some emotional moments just seeing like some of the things like the the newer elon and and him like with noria's um notebook and going to visit those places bro i don't know why that got me dude oh uh the re reunion between prospera and airy like actually getting to see airy and hold her like that's that was a lot for me it's a happy ending i don't know how often gundam has happy endings i liked it i like a happy ending happy ending is good 
I do, I will say that I do kind of wish that uh, it was longer. I wish that like the story that we got over the course of the two seasons, that's like, I'm fine with that, right? I wish it would have been like three cores or three seasons, same amount, like, like, like 36 episodes instead of 24. And I wish that it would have just built things out more along it. There were definitely some moments that stood out where it was the world building and stuff and character growth, especially for like ghoul and stuff as he sees what what's up with Earth and Mirine as she sees what's up with Earth and um, seeing Prospera's goals and how she fucking doesn't care about anything or anyone but the 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 things and people she cares about. Uh, she's very like focused on just Aerie. That's pretty much it. She doesn't, she doesn't like, she will sacrifice everyone else. She, she was even willing to sacrifice Soleta for Aerie. It's kind of fucky-wucky, I don't like that. But she gets her redemption because even the villain gets redemption in, in stories and you gotta get a happy ending. And she's part of the happy ending because that's Soleta's mom. That was great. I think that was a good, first look at, at at Gundams, you know, as a as a series. Gundam, I, my first venture into Gundam. I think it was my good, it was good for my first venture into Gundam. I, I don't know. Love to know what you all thought about this episode. What did you think about the entire series of Witch from Mercury? This season, the entire series as a whole. Let me know in the comments below. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, then like the video and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one. Until next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.